Portland. You're listening to Portland, Oregon's own Nameless Gamers PDX Podcast. Headshot. We sit around and talk about games while drinking the finest micro brews in the Pacific Northwest. Search for us on Facebook or reach us on Twitter at iLeggedOut. Send us an email to namelessgamerspdx at gmail.com or head over to our website, namelessgamerspdx.com. Thanks for listening and don't forget to subscribe. Hey everybody, welcome to the Nameless Gamers PDX Podcast, where it's a podcast about video games and Wilson. love and loss and perseverance and bravery and courage. And <laughs> that's that's and, us, man. And, uh, that's yeah. what this <laughs> that's what this show is all about. Word. And we're gonna we're not gonna we're probably not gonna talk about a lot of that, but we will we will probably we'll talk cover that about first topic. Yeah, we yeah probably talk about video games. Yeah, <laughs> I feel like video games. How do you guys feel? Video games. Yeah, I, I, yeah. yeah. thumbs up, thumbs up all around. All yeah, right. yeah. New, got, I'm gonna got, claim neutrality on that one. We got thumbs up all around. A <laughs> uh, couple things we're gonna talk about today on this episode. If you're uh, listening to us, we will be talking about. The Xbox One update that just happened. I don't know if you have Xboxes, but if you do, we will be talking about that a little bit. We'll be talking about the Nintendo 2DS XL, uh, and the Oculus Rift <laughs> is going for pretty damn cheap, and we're, we're going to talk about yeah. that. Hey, guys, if you want to uh, support the podcast, visit us at www.patreon.com slash I lagged out. Um Thanks for checking that out. If, if you, if you have, uh, we appreciate, uh, the help Twitter at I lagged out. You can follow us there. We appreciate, uh, you telling, tell, tell a friend about the show. Tell a friend, follow us on Twitter. Follow us on Twitter yourself if you Spread don't the already. Um, and, and all that good stuff. You can also email us direct nameless gamers PDX at gmail.com. Uh, so right up front, thank you all for, for listening and, and subscribing and, and participating and all that good stuff. We really appreciate it. Uh, I got a room full today. Um, Jess is here. <laughs> Jess, how, how's it going? What's up, everybody? Glad to have you back. Welcome Ooh, back to the show. show. Thank you. Thank R- you. Round of applause for Jess. Jess started the show with us. Uh, took a little bit of a hiatus and, uh, took a, took a hiatus. And, uh, she's spreading she'll be, peace around the world. Yeah. In and out. Good on you. Yeah. Always welcome, of course. In and out, spotty. You um, know, the Peace Corps. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. How you doing, Jess? How, how's everything going? Oh, you know, it's going. Working yeah. and gaming. Yeah. Yeah. Any, I'd rather uh, game than work. Okay. Wouldn't well, wouldn't we, we all? all? Right, yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Fucking yeah. Bill. Yeah. Yeah. It's real, real kick in the but dick. If only you could that game stuff. for work. Oh, that'd be so awesome. Mm. Then you'd hate to do it, right? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, we'll cross yeah. that bridge when we get there. Yeah. I'll worry <laughs> yeah. about that headache. It'd take a while. It'd yeah. take a while. <laughs> and then we have our usual suspects, Ben. How's it going, buddy? Uh, oh, hey, Ben. Good. Ben, too. Things are going okay. Talk to me. Anything new with you? Um, I, Check I f- in. I fixed my uh, stereo in the truck, so that's okay. Handy. The commute okay. to work has gotten much more enjoyable. All right. Nice. Yeah. No, no yeah. more crappy uh, stereo speakers yeah. anymore. Yeah, they're, they're pretty much all blown. I bought a used, beat up truck, and yeah. everything is basically blown and popped. <laughs> and happens. it was like, a, you know, what are you gonna do anyway? But uh, yeah, it's not gonna cool. get louder if you don't turn it up, right? Fucking <laughs> a. <laughs> Speaking of which, Scott's here. Scott. Woo, I'm gonna turn it up a notch. Oh, buddy! Ow. Only one. How you? How you doing, Scott? I'm, I'm doing good. I had a decent week of life. You know, all right. things doing all right. It's warming up. It's not ridiculously hot like a few weeks ago. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I think it's hot there. enough. I guess, yeah, like it's, yeah. It's, it's I could live right. with this year round. Yeah, yeah. we're I in a good really spot. Think yeah. it needs Great. to be over seventy five. Like. Yeah, eighty is okay. Seventy five to eighty five, I'm okay. Once once it starts kissing cl- closer to ninety, that's when it's like yeah. it's just too damn hot. If you can anything, open yeah. your windows, open a few windows, get a nice Crack breeze em. going, yeah, mm-hmm. and and it doesn't get too damn hot, yeah, you know it's 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 nice enough, yeah. So it's doesn't perfect. Be. It's it's kind of in that right weather area where you know you, yeah, have a window yeah. open. Get that yeah, good cross breeze going. Yeah, you get to work. You work in an open air garage, so you're yeah. Kinda, I work yeah. I work outdoors, so like that's fun. this is. Just right, man. I can yeah. drink some water and wipe a little bit of sweat. I'm not getting uh, yeah. you're not freezing. My office doesn't even have windows. Yeah, if I want to see what's going on outside, I have to get up and walk out of the back door. <laughs> Speaking of people that do work outdoors, 
How about somebody that doesn't? Tony, how you doing? <laughs> I'm doing good. Actually, speaking of work, uh, I took this whole week off. Yeah. Nice. What? So uh, Working hard. That must working. be rough. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's been real rough, you know, getting up when the fuck I want, doing whatever I want, drinking beer whenever I want. Yeah, it's going to be a real, you know, I miss those worst. days. It's so terrible. It's a real kick in the it's dick. It's just, guy. oh, it's awful. Yeah, it's got to be pretty Man. bad. Sounds terrible. Yeah. Um, how about you, Randy? How you doing? I'm doing all right. Um, glad to be here. Um, to do this, looking forward to the events we have coming up, um, and all that good stuff. And, uh, and, and we might, might talk about that a little bit going forward. Uh, we do have some gaming stuff to get into, which woo-hoo, I kind of want to get into. But before we get into that, Scott left us with a question, uh, last episode we, we recorded. And, uh, Scott, what was that question and what did you hear? Okay. We had a, we had a semi expanding question here. Um, the question I left was like, do you regularly play your video games uh, as a good person or an evil person? You know, do right. you pick the bad questions? You know, do you do you kill the person? Do you let them live? Yeah. Uh, I mean, nowadays, let's, let's get into it. Nowadays, most video games, a lot of them will give you, they either give you somewhat, they give you a little bit of leeway with being <laughs> yeah. evil. There's usually like or, a good choice and a bad choice yeah. in most scenarios. And, then, and yeah. a lot of times a neutral, a good, bad, neutral. Yeah, or like, like they okay. don't even yeah. give you a choice. Like they just don't yeah. give you a choice. Yeah. You know, like it's either continue on the game as a good person or die. Game's over for you. You know, you're going to replay it. Um, I think a lot of people thought to themselves like, oh, yeah, you know, there's so many games out there where you can be evil. It's kind of, if it's if they give you the option to be evil, uh, excluding GTA, because right. nobody plays any GTA game to be the good guy. <laughs> this, we're, we're excluding GTA from yeah. from this uh, thought process. I think there's pretty only, like, sure, I yeah. think there's, all you, all you, the only benefit to being good in GTA is... Uh, well, there's no like choice. The, yeah, the ambulance, think. right? I mean, you can unlock. Or the yeah. cop. Or was a cab missions yeah. you could do? You, know, you, you can like do cab missions yeah. and the ambulance missions. You unlock those in your The cab missions game. are a good, honest living. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Uh, sure. If you actually <laughs> bang the hookers instead of killing them, yeah, you get, you get discounts. <laughs> you bang them and properly months, pay them you know? instead of, you know, killing uh, them afterwards. So, I mean, really, I mean, and we kind of expanded into, like, a... That hot coffee territory. Ouch. <laughs> the uh, oh, the, like an alignment. Um, some people know what yes. we're talking about. Some alignment. people don't. The old D um, styles. Yeah, for people that don't know or never played like any in depth like role playing game like Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah. Uh, GURPS things like that. Shadowrun. They gave you an alignment where you could make your character like lawfully good, lawfully neutral, like lawfully evil, evil, chaotic. This like yeah. chaotic lawful or chaotic good, chaotic evil. Yeah. They're really yeah. in depth. Yeah, but unfortunately, they don't put that system in a whole lot of games. Unless it's a specific. Yeah, you usually have you usually have like based like on uh, those types yeah. of yeah, or like a D&D way more is sort of that. Yeah. Like the pioneer of that. Yeah, like, well, like in depth. The old Baldur's Gates had those. I remember. Um, really? Not on any of the consoles. They didn't have any though. Like they, you could be the, like the a old necromancer. PC Maybe PC. Yeah. yeah oh, okay. Like, you could be a necromancer, but even then, you weren't given like evil options. You were just that was just your power. You yeah. know, but like, so like there was kind of a, a ride, a wide range. Um, unfortunately, there have been studies on this <laughs> and most people, they want to say they're bad. Like, oh yeah, I picked the evil choices. Um, yeah. On your second time playing around. Yeah. Most people were yeah, honest. The on first like, time through, you're, you're, you're like, you play good. You're going to be, you, you try to do the right thing. Yeah. Right? And you, yeah. Yeah. you want to, you want to, you want to play as the character and progress in the story. Yeah. And you, in most stories, you're trying to be a good guy. Yeah. You know, um, unless, you have, want, unless you want those achievements. Yeah. Unless yeah. You, yeah. There, there are, are the those. But that's usually most people will still play the first round as the good guy and yeah. maybe go around for a second loop as yeah. somebody Just pure evil. Something yeah. So, yeah. so I have an example of something is is uh, kind of touch on what you're saying. Uh-huh. But uh, so like Fallout Four yeah. has an oh, achievement yeah. for you to like pull the pin out of a grenade and put it in someone's pocket. <laughs> <laughs> and then just kind of walk off. <laughs> like, that's an achievement. Surprise! But like, uh, you're a, you don't Fallout have 3 really... actually has one that's yeah, similar where you, yeah. you so, basically yeah. lost, yes, yes. Uh, fire off a nuke on the first town that you come across. Yeah, so... And just blow up the whole town. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, <laughs> Shit. To, so, so my point is, though, is that I think maybe yeah. certain, <laughs> certain games and certain developers are clever enough to, like, 
you don't have to pick an alignment. You can sort of you just gain reputation with whatever you're doing. Yeah, you, you know, sneak like dick move more. in there. Yeah, every yeah. once in a while, yeah. and then you gain or lose reputation with that. You know, faction. faction based on that. You know, yeah, yeah. But most of them didn't have it too specific. Um, we did have one. Uh, we got one on Twitter. Uh, Mr. O'Reilly did say he was chaotic neutral. Right. Um, which is for most yeah. people that don't know, it's, it's kind of in depth. You're somebody that does not care either way. As long as it doesn't affect you, you're not going to really make a decision. You're looking out for yeah. you. First. You look but out you're, for you're not, you. You're not law abiding yourself. You're a selfish yeah. You're prick. not, you're yeah. not drawn into like if right. two, hey, two man, groups are having a situation. Yeah, like yeah. if two groups are having a fight, right, right. Is, if it doesn't affect you, you're just gonna you're let fine. them fight. Yeah. You're gonna let them go. But I do think- that. That happens to me at Seven Eleven like every day. <laughs> <laughs> right? Jeez, you go to a bad Seven <laughs> Eleven. Well, I mean, you pull up in the parking, you know, stuff. Yeah, it's. Uh, I just need to get. I need to get to work. Yeah. I ain't got time for that. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> so, like, I'll have to admit, I probably play more good. I do do some random evil shit. Not, not really like. Uh, yeah. I usually don't play like a whole game as like a dick as much as uh, yes. yeah. unless there is an achievement. Um, I did like Fable. Fable is probably the only one that I saw or remember that really had a an effect from choosing like evil or good. Yeah. Or like yeah. if you played Fable and you played good, you looked like this like nice knight. And yeah, you got would better looking. You and you everybody's glowed. totally good. I think you got you had a halo at one point, didn't yeah. you? Yeah, yeah. If you get high real well. Yeah, yeah. If you get your yeah. high enough right now, and you get it's a such halo. a bummer that yeah. we are not gonna be seeing like. <laughs> Somebody needs to take I'm over that IP. Fable. Like that's got to be a thing. Uh, mm. I don't know. I, I don't that's know. Is there. it just they over? were all they were know. all really yeah. disappointed. I really I liked. It. Well, I, the third one I didn't like that. The second one was my favorite one. I, I liked all of yeah. them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I played we, through you, them. But you like, and I played the third one. one Every one was not what it promised to be. It was. Yeah. Most of them were almost, but it just and then there was there was that little bit they said it was going to be, and I was like, God damn it! Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so I mean, do, do you guys? I mean, it's kind of it's like after asking the question, it's kind of like, eh, it's yeah, kinda hard to say. Like, I, I try to be good, good but option. I end up being like, I think I end up being more, I guess, if you can say chaotic, good. Yeah. Like when it comes to major story po- po- plot points. plot points, I'll do the good guy move, but uh-huh. like I'll run around. I'm. St- I'm stealing <laughs> everything. everything I can get my hands on. I'm as long you know, as you're not getting caught. If nobody's kind of looking, yeah. Is, no is looking. anybody going to see me if I kill this guy? Like you have a little <laughs> meter where, the, where it shows you if you're like right. in view of other people or whatever. Oh shit! Somebody saw like, me. It's like <laughs> wow. Okay. Well, there's only yeah. one witness to take out. I got him too. Let's go. You know what I mean? Like yeah. it's, it's like damn it. And you got to pay. I want to like try to be guards. the good guy, but it's just too fucking easy. It's too easy to just yeah, kill dude. him and take yeah. what I need. I don't want to go <laughs> fucking grind out yeah money and do it right. It's right there. Yeah. Right. I'd rather you, kill people yeah. for their gold. Yep. Yeah. yeah. What about Sometimes you, Randy? You uh, normally play yeah, uh, yeah, um, goody, goody I think two I, shoes. I think, well, it's it's sort of like Ben. Like it, it just kind of depends on the circumstance. Yeah. I guess. Mm-hmm. And like, I mean, there's obviously, and the thing about it is too, like especially with like video games, there's there's obvi- like certain quests or missions or whatever, depending on the game you're playing, whatever, uh, are definitely geared more towards like. Well, if you do this and complete this, <laughs> you know that's bad, right? Right. <laughs> and then some of them are like, or if you do this, it's really good. It's going to give you a good rep. You're going to, you, you know, you oh, go save a guy, you know, like, okay, that's always going to be good rep, right? Yeah. yeah. So it just kind of depends on like, because some quests sort of steer you in the wrong direction intentionally, yes. I think very much by the developer. So it just kind of depends, you know, like if a lot of times it might depend on sometimes what's easier too and like (laughs) if i just want to do the easiest if i'm trying to find the path of least resistance that's sort of the way that i'll go in a game depending um and then sometimes it's just depending on the type of game it's like well you know you kind of pick and choose what you do like open (laughs) Um, world you know they don't really give you too Um, many options yeah they kind of keep you along the same so i don't really have like an alignment i guess um i and i know this is a little off topic and maybe this can be like a some uh, something a little further down, maybe next week's question or a question we ask later, but like, does anybody pick like, like when you're making a character, do you just pick a chick or? Yeah. I, or I, yeah, do. Do you always make a chick Absolutely. or do you always pick a dude or like? It depends on what I can I make the chick look like. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to fucking answer that honestly. Uh, right yeah. Okay. That's, you that's, know, that's fair. Um, right. Or if there's actual like a difference yeah. between like traits. Yeah, I mean, I I, I might, I, I, I might know. pick a woman. Yeah, but. yeah, um, yeah. I get that. Like, 
I don't know. Uh, right. So, yeah. like, alignment, I really don't know, but I was just thinking about that. Like, it just popped in my head. Maybe we should ask that later, but... Um, <laughs> yeah, so I really don't, I guess... Well, it kind of comes down to my alignment is what's easiest usually. Yeah. <laughs> how do you want? How do you want the people in the game, the NPC to people, to you? react to you? Yeah. 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 Like if you're the good guy, and you come you into a into town, town or a village. Like everybody just runs up to you and they're like, uh, "Hey, buy yeah, me a drink. Like Give me some yeah. food. Hey, you got any money? You know, you, they, yeah. I would like a drink and shit. Or if you're just fucking evil, they all just scatter. You're yeah. Like, cool. Nobody's asking. No for one's this. seeing me now. And I'm like, here I am all alone in the store. Look at this. <laughs> this is mine. This is mine. This is mine. This is mine. This is an easier mind of the day. This is great. <laughs> you know yeah. I mean? There are, there are definitely benefits. Yeah. Um, anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, that's kind of. Uh, what about you, Tony? So I was, I've been thinking about this since the, the last episode and it's one of those where you were saying like, you know, a lot of times you just end up, like I end up myself, um, end up picking up like the good options and like really have to try to pick yeah. the bad options. Games I'm thinking of specifically were like the Mass Effect series, the first three of yeah. them, where you uh-huh. get a real, or the old uh, Knights of the Old Republic, um, that series too. That one had a lot of, you know, you could go anywhere from a Jedi to like, you know, a Dark Jedi, you know, and or right. anything in between. Okay. So, you know, that, that had the old D&D type thing, but it was with, uh, you know, Star Wars, Star Wars versions, yeah. Of- so, oh, okay. um, but yeah, I, like I have to force myself to actually try and like it's not intentional, Stay on the but light, it's like on the side of the light. No, I have yeah. to force myself to not, yeah, to pick like bad things if I want to have a character <laughs> that's kind of a little on the bad side. Times you just stop and think about <laughs> yeah. it. Like, yeah, I, I want to be want to kill that fucking asshole. I just <laughs> yeah. don't like him. Yeah. Just don't yeah, that's the that problem too. Like in Fable, there. when you come across the first people, they're like, "Hey, he's a chicken chaser," and it's like, "What'd you call me? Uh, I'm gonna punch this lady." Oh, he's a chicken no, chaser. You're lucky they didn't let me have the weapons in the city, you bastards. Yeah. Yeah. This bitch called me it. Fuck you, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> you just declared war, lady. Fuck you. <laughs> so what if I kick chickens? <laughs> what about you, Jessica? I know you've been playing a lot of like role playing style games lately. I do a little bit. Do you I go do. evil route? I mean, typically I go, like, mostly good the first time (laughs) through, you know, for for story purposes. Yeah. Mm. But I always remember, I'm going to fucking kill you the next time I play. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) I like your weapon. (sighs) You are. I want a cool weapon, man. I will have that next next (laughs) playthrough. Your (laughs) name is in the book. Stuff I want or wait. What did you just say to me? (sighs) Oh. Where I'm you sit there with the notebook, like writing these characters' names down, you're like, "Fuck you!" It's, I'm it's, taking it's notes. like the it's the old <laughs> meme where it's like it shows like someone in like Elder Scrolls, like a character in Elder Scrolls, and it's like, "I hope this guy isn't part of the main story because I really like his weapon." <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, as for all for all the people and blustering that we do about being evil and making jackass decisions and killing people, we're all. I want to say morally upstanding video gamers. Right. <laughs> Pat yourself but, on the back for that one, America. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. It's all good. It's all good. Word. Yeah, but, but uh, uh, I think now we're going to send it on over to Uncle Ben over here. With the, uh, ah, you guys want to The games, yeah. times, and the trivia. Let's do I got some questions. So the way this works, Ben's going to ask us some questions. We're going to try to answer them. Uh, the best we can. That's how it do. And everyone uh, that listens to this show will be eventually screaming. Uh, <laughs> yeah, answers at some point. Yeah, and I'm uh, sorry for that. That's we're, hey, look, we're pretty good, but we don't we don't hundred percent it. Uh, we we do pretty good. Sometimes we hundred percent. Sometimes, it. sometimes. Yeah. We do. Um, but he's gonna ask us a question. We're just going to try I got to a, get uh, it. This is all just gonna be a plethora, random assortment of video game related. All right, uh, you know. Things. Let me just test this out right quick. Seems oh. to be working. All right. right. Uh, let's just go right down the rabbit hole with what year did the Sonic the Hedgehog make its debut? Anyone? 1992. Ooh. Ooh. 91. 19- Damn, I knew I was close. 91. I was, was good. I was, was thinking 92. We, we, I think we had well, talked about Randy. that a couple okay, episodes this ago. This motherfucker did the Price is Right shit. Yes. <laughs> where it's did. like, oh, I'll just go a dollar less. <laughs> no, Price is Right, you go did a he, dollar did, He got him a point, though. Or a I dollar mean, more. You know, yeah. Those tax shakes work. It worked. It, he got it. They he got worked. It. it totally worked. What am I going to say 1980-something for Sonic? No. We were just talking about when Sonic became the flagship character for... Yeah. Right? And then with the... Yeah. Anyway. All right. I was wrong. Ah, ah. What item will yeah, grant right. 
Invincibility to Crash Bandicoot. Oh, I, ooh, 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 I was ready to hit the dinger. Bandicoot, Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, no, no, I know. Is it a, is it a <laughs> box with Roger stars on it? Uh, uh, no, no. Yeah. I have to. That that that's a bear. A, a, it's a thing. You, you were gonna say bear trap, weren't you? Barrel. No. no. Box. In Bandicoot, everything comes from a box in, yeah, in, Bandi- in, the, in the old Crash series. Because I remember, I remember like apples, and I remember like TNT. There were there are TNT barrels. TNT yeah. there, are, there are. I'm there say are. TNT um, was bad. They look like apples, but they're called like mango. They're called like like Bandicoot fruit or some shit. I don't know what sure, they're called. Fruit. Not? Yeah. Anyway, why not? The why uh, why? the I'll um, give it. You want me to give it to you? Yeah. I, yeah, I, the I, mask. <gasps> the ma- the the, the, Incan the little mask, mask? yeah, it's like oh, an yeah. Incan, uh, yeah, well, yeah. some sort of weird. It's got feathers on it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. If I think if you, get, if you get three, three of them, around, right? yeah, if you get like three masks, uh, you're invincible masks, for a while. Really? Then you get like like well, when you first pick it up, it just floats around, crash, and and it'll take the first hit. Yeah, and because oh, okay. okay. crash can only take one hit. Yeah, um, unless you get a mask, and then you get a second mask. Yeah. I think that's when it has feathers, and then you get the third one. Like crash puts on. A big mask, and for the you know, it's like the star in Mario. For a, a short time, you, nothing can hurt you except falling into a hole or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, yeah. the uh, okay. His name was Aku Aku, but me uh, like when I was playing, me and all my buddies, like, we just called it Ooga Booga because when you pick him up, oh. he goes Ooga Booga, and, and you, got him, you know, and he's just floating <laughs> and then, around. And, and, anyway, all right. and he's your homie. Yeah. Uh, uh, who can tell me what is the name of the soul devouring blade that is the main enemy from? Soul Caliber. Soul Edge. Ooh. Hey, somebody nice. knows this shit. That's quick, dude. I mean, I that was the was name of an actual soul version of Soul Caliber. Right? Yeah. 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 Was it? Okay. Yeah, yeah. That was Nightmare yeah. Sword. Um, all right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. How many DLC expansions did Fallout 3 have? Three. Four. Fallout 3? Seven. Five. Two. I heard a five, five yeah. in there. <laughs> nice. We got a five. So the pit. Can, can we, you name them? Oh, okay. Shit, the yeah, pit. Yeah. These guys here. The, okay. The pit um, is one of them. That's uh, one. There's um, the. That's all I got. <laughs> <laughs> that, I, I, will say, I will say that's number two. Oh, wait. There's. Uh, okay. Hold on. Yeah. There's, there's. I never played any of the DLC oh, for no? Fallout. Yeah. Anyway, three. no. I can I give just played you. a little bit of Vegas. Operation Anchorage. Sure. Uh, okay, okay, so I know these that names. It's going like to piss me off it's, as it's you really progressively off, go through this because, like, I know them and the Louisiana just, they're not there. But yeah. the, the pit, yeah. broken steel, mm-hmm. point, mm-hmm. lookout. Yeah. What's the last one? I don't know. Otherwise, I would have fucking guessed that. Mother, mothership. Mother. That's right. They mothership they, uh, yep. Zeta. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. That's all right. right. All right. All right. Hey, that list is right. <laughs> <laughs> It's been Randy check. Hooray! Confirm. Verified check. <laughs> Fuck stamp it. All right. Yep. Randy Ring it off. Check. What, what game am I playing? If I need to use a heart key, a spade key, and a diamond key, and a club key. Kingdom Hearts. To get through the police station. Oh. Ma- Mappy? Or, uh, no, no, no. Ah. <sighs> uh, oh. This uh, is, uh. Is that Resident Evil? Oh, okay. yes, it is. Okay. It I is. was thinking that, That's, but it was like, uh, Resident Evil that 2? Specifically Resident Evil 2. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yep, you're, yep. And 64? No. Yes. All right. Did you know the That's, police that, station has a heart key? So, That's five questions. Okay. I have so, a list. So look, we I'm going to have to get that Resident Evil 2. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The N64 version. No. I'm going to have to get that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, totally, so, totally. Yeah, we're going to have to do that. You guys so, want You guys want to do one more? Uh, what do you want? How are we feeling? Uh, Let's brain? take okay. We'll do we, one more. We, we we'll, do one. we'll do one more, and then we'll take a break, and then we'll do that. Right, Let's do right. one more. Let's do, Let's one, do more. one more. One more. In Donkey Kong Country, what item gives you the extra life? The one up. The balloon. balloon. Yeah. Hey. All right. I didn't think you guys would. Uh, we put good job. Like red two weeks balloon. Ago. Oh, did you? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and there was apparently right. like there was like, you could get a, a blue balloon was like three lives, green balloon, uh, the green one. I think there were, yep, yeah. there, were there were different colored balloons. Were yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I loved loved the swimming levels. Very relaxing music on the Donkey Kong. <laughs> All right, <laughs> All right, okay. We're gonna take a break. We'll when we come back, we yeah. will hit you guys up with a little bit of Xbox One update, uh, Nintendo two uh, DS XL news, and a uh, little information and some insight on the Oculus Rift price drop which is uh, happening out there will be probably we'll, we'll be right back after this lovely ooh, ooh, song about mattresses 
This episode of Nameless Gamers PDX Podcast is brought to you in part by Casper. I don't know about you, but I value a good night's sleep. If you're looking for a sleep cheat code, we recommend Casper. Casper is an online retailer of premium mattresses for a fraction of the price. They're a new hybrid mattress that combines premium latex foam with memory foam, so they're extra comfortable. They also have a risk-free trial and return policy. Try sleeping on a Casper for 100 days with free delivery and painless returns. You can get $50 towards any mattress purchase by visiting www.casper.com slash friends slash NGPDX. What are you waiting for? Go to casper.com slash friends slash NGPDX and get your $50 and get started today. Thanks, Casper. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to the Nameless Gamers PDX podcast, uh, where we talk about video games. Um, and um, so we're glad that that uh, commercial about mattresses is in the past. <laughs> you <should> sleep. <laughs> speaking, yeah. speaking of the past... Um, let's talk about a little, a little bit of game in history. And, uh, we're going to have Je- Jess. We're going to her story. Let's get her in episode. there to spearhead this bad boy. <laughs> that's, that's, yeah. that's great. <laughs> <laughs> Real great, Ben. Thanks. Yeah. Thank you for being generous. Right. Right. Thanks for making gaming jokes. Yeah. yeah. So I got a little bit of gaming history. All right. <laughs> so, uh, in 1981. Nintendo released Donkey Kong for Arcade, ah, which was the first appearance of Donkey Kong and Mario. Mm, right. Right. Uh, Jumpman. Well, was Jumpman in, I think, before it was released. It was, it was Actually, his name was Howard. A lot of people don't know that. Uh, <laughs> no, just old Howard. He was a carpenter. Yeah. yeah. Jesus. No, it was not. Jumpman yeah, and was Pauline. His name was Jesus. Was before she was Mario <laughs> and Peach. Yeah. A lot of people think he's Italian. That's not true. His actual name is Jesus. He's from Mexico. <laughs> Hey, in, in that Cristo. game. <sighs> Anyways, <laughs> uh, in 1990, uh, sorry, 1984, uh, Data East released Arcade Karate Champion. Oh, this and is it the uh, started the oh. fighting genre. Is that the yeah. one with the the two sticks? Yeah, 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 yeah like okay, yeah. you know, do your half circle, semi circle, yeah. cut across. No buttons. Yeah, yeah, that game fucking yeah. that was sucked. It really <laughs> did. It, it really did. Yeah. Yeah. Even when you knew what you were doing, it was like you're programming with two sticks. It was just <laughs> yeah, silly. You know that game all came down to timing. Yes, it definitely. You, you did. if you didn't do your little freaking code thing with the sticks at the right moment, yeah, it, it you you died. Yeah, you did it. You had to do it just fucking right. It was real weird. martial arts. Yeah. Pain in the arse. Yes. Because at a young age, and what was that, 1984? 1984. Yeah. This is when you want to, uh, I want to put a quarter in and yeah, mash some buttons. Didn't have and the, They just didn't have any yeah, fucking didn't buttons. Have that yeah. Type of, yes. What are you going to do? Not a fun. Yeah. A three year old child does not have the skills. Yeah. I feel like Ben champion. was the only one old yeah. enough to probably put a quarter in a machine yeah. at that time. <laughs> I, well, I did. Not I did. I played, we played Karate Champion you know. at a shitty pizza parlor and the sticks were always greasy and stuff. There's always yeah. like, there was like the group of like four or five old. regular kids hanging out. Yeah. And one dude knew what he was doing. It was always everybody trying to beat that guy. And it was yep. like, man, there's the fuck this little man. Stop being 35. Man. What are yeah. you doing? 35 year old guy <laughs> playing. Playing that in, in there. Yeah. <laughs> he like, probably he worked there what? or something. Stop working. Take off that apron. I think his name was. I think his, it was. His Take kid's off name, your his pants. His name was Frankie. He didn't work there. He was just. Oh. He just the neighborhood kid. He hung. Did he ever out. tell we you hung, to we relax? We all hung out there. <laughs> in those you, days, Frank. did he ever tell you to relax? Frankie didn't say relax. No. <laughs> it seems like a miss. <laughs> Frankie said, "Oh, you must I concentrate." On the uh-huh. game. That yeah, you're right. You yeah. Nope. Yep. Frankie was definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie was, was an good at the game, see? Okay. Moving on. We're, we're getting off topic here. <laughs> no, no. Uh, <laughs> There's no we in this here, Ben. That's, <laughs> all, you. That's all, all, all you. Okay, what? maybe. We, okay, right. I was going to say maybe we should talk a little bit more about Frankie, <laughs> but I feel like we're just giving up on Frankie so easy. <laughs> yeah. I almost no. feel like we're letting him down in a way. But, He's got a um, speech impediment. Okay, we'll move on. We'll Fuck move that on. guy. We can always do a little we can, we'll Frankie co- a little we'll, later. Maybe we we'll circle, circle back. back. Yeah. <laughs> Frankie. So Love instead Frankie. of Frankie. In 1987, Leisure Loot, Leisure Suit Larry was released oh, for oh. and Apple II. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. really. Those I'm those were go- those uh, were c- coming out with those for a while. I think like the yeah. last 
ones were somewhere in the early 2000s. Dude, are they still? Tell me. There's, there was one on Nintendo 64. Is there yeah, not no, one? No, but yeah, they, right. they, they, or, they kept making yeah. them. Is there not one on Android right now? There might there might be. I Probably. Don't I, don't, I don't know. It seems like that would be a thing, but I don't know. Anyway. Yeah. yeah. Look it up, I, I mean, that was... Before I had found out about the Atari uh, porno games... <laughs> side note in your life everybody can go google that i totally like, know what Leisure you're talking Suit about larry was like that is oh my god like the point yeah. is you're trying to have you're like you're actually trying, trying to bang get this broad right. yeah you're yeah. trying to find a chick to go have sex with yeah it's like a point and click adventure shit. game mm-hmm. uh, mm-hmm. that you try to bone down on these chicks bone down on some uh, bitches as a, as a as a guy named as Larry. a real <laughs> weird looking dude, uh, I can't believe I've never pound. played any of these games. <laughs> yeah, that, well, that was a PC, normally yeah. a PC type yeah. situation. So yeah. if you weren't weren't doing that at that, and they weren't, uh, they weren't the best. Quality. I don't recommend you revisit that at all. Um, but they weren't really like they were uh, there. explicit. No, no, like, no. They you weren't. Know, like, you know, it, 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 they were fucking. It's like stupid. Nintendo, as close as Nintendo could get. And I'm not saying Nintendo made this or had anything to do Larry with Larry Laffer. Like, Nintendo was Larry like, Laffer? That's his name if you're, if you're looking it. for... Um, it was like Nintendo. Images. So it was kind of just like all innuendo type of... Yeah. Type yeah. of games. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then, uh, so in 1988, we had Nintendo discontinue Nintendo Fun Club... Oh, and what? change it to the Nintendo Power Magazine. Ah, oh. so that's when that all started. Oh, yeah. and you know, you all remember the wrong colored Mario on the first one of those. Yes, yeah. yes, yeah, his shit was all fucked up. There were a few other little not so good things going on with that it's Nintendo like, Power. Magazine you guys are supposed cover. to be the Nintendo <laughs> like magazine. You fuck up your own, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, character. Well, pay you attention, know. idiots. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Lots of good publications. I do remember a lot of Nintendo Power. Yeah, I, I like, had a subscription for a while. And Game Pro. It, it Game Pro fun. was another big one that was at the time. Really? Yeah. I had I had a Game Informer subscription for a Game while. Pro had like weird ass names for like their editor or like their, I don't know, their journalists or editors or whatever. It was like Sushi Sam. Oh, And like sure. a little picture of like a guy with like a Karate Kid type headband <laughs> and like sunglasses <laughs> And like yeah, they stopped that real, after a while. It was while, almost like racist. Yeah, <laughs> it was real yeah. bad. He, they stopped that after a, a he while. Was a sushi, though. yeah, chef. And there was like guy yeah. that anyway. played games, but that was Game Pro. It's a whole different ball game. What else happened? In- uh, so I only got one more thing. Uh, 2003, we had Mario Golf Toadstool Tour. Oh yeah, I enjoyed that. Golf I enjoyed ever. some of that. Yeah, Mario Golf yeah. Good. yeah. Was that on? It was on uh, GameCube. Game yes. Cube. Yeah, Mario dude, Golf was good. Yes. That was good. I remember having parties up at your fucking yeah, dude. at your place. Like, just yeah. yeah, everybody's playing a golf game. Wait, what? Yeah, this is like even more odd than like I can remember. Yeah, like, there was like three, eight or four of us men playing tennis, and we're fucking. Uh, you could taunt. Yeah. yeah, you could taunt in that golf Not game when it wasn't your turn. You had a taunt button that would be like go, 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 or depending on which character you were, it said. Uh, yeah, okay. mm-hmm. Anyway, that was fun. That was just so it many was. different different versions. Fun. Different uh, difficulties and hazards in mm-hmm. a game. Yeah. In the game, it was uh, it was like it was like a golf it. game, mini golf, but not mini golf. It's kind of like holes. Mario. Like, you know what I mean? Like, Hot Shots was like a blend yeah. of like Mario and that sort of yeah. Game. yeah. It was Hot like Shots Hot Shots with Mario type. Was but Hot Shots yeah. had Hot Shots had like Hot Shots power. Was yeah, Hot Shots was a little strokes, different. And you yeah. could like it smash was the ball with a rocket and blah blah blah. But like like the Mario Golf, yeah. Kind of like the Remember the, there was one where you're like you're like you're in the Donkey Kong one. Your 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 greens are up in trees, yeah. giant trees. Remember if you missed was, it, yeah. it was off into somewhere. So kind of like, like that was like the old uh, golden tee arcades yeah. a little bit because those always had those weird um, yeah. courses where like yeah. you're on like a plateau and like yep. you got to go from plateau to plateau. So yeah, similar to the yeah. Donkey Kong. You got to chip it. Yeah, yeah. There's, no, there's no skipping that second island because you, you just can't hit it that far. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. yeah. You miss. Fun. You miss the first shot. You you your hold the whole hole's gone. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Everybody else mm-hmm. is gonna be like, okay, adjust from there. But yeah. that's, uh, that's still. I'm gonna put that up it there. Is. That's a, that's a fun, it's a fun game. Yeah. Um, it is. That cool. was always. Top, I still have a game cube somewhere. Top and, golf games game ever. I think so. I don't uh, know why we're not like, all playing that right now. <laughs> Toadstool Golf and Metroid Prime uh, are about yeah, the Metroid's only games I bought. I think the wife bought one of the 
Wario Party games. The Mario, Mario Party. Those yeah, are okay. Right. So there, there was a Mario good. Party, and then there was a, a Wario. Was there a Wario? There was a like okay. Wario Party. It was an independent game. Not not a WarioWare, but a Wario. It, no, yeah, WarioWare. Wario Wario it, it was WarioWare. Wario was it one for the Wii? No, or? it was it was GameCube because we were passing the oh, controller cute. around. Okay. Okay, maybe. Yeah. And it was like it was like uh, it was it just dumped you right into random mini games and you had oh, that is no clue yeah. 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 what yeah. was to happen. That is, that is yeah. Yeah. It was yeah. like it was like, oh and I'm pushing you might something have to and hit buttons working. in sequence and, yeah. or you might have to move. It was things really around bizarre. Or, yeah. That's yeah. WarioWare. Yep. Yeah. And those those actually became really popular on uh handhelds later on. Those types I could totally see that. Yeah. yeah. I could see um, that. You just pass it off and it's like good luck, dude. Yeah. Either nailed it or you, you failed miserably. Yeah, WarioWare like, is great. It's yeah. great. And there's a bunch of different iterations. Just like Mario Party, WarioWare yes. has a bunch of different iterations and yeah. stuff like that, too. So, yeah, it turned out pretty good. What about... Um, Tony, do you have any news you want to share with the... Oh, uh, yeah, we got some news. Um, <laughs> with the fellas <laughs> and the gals. Is it fake news or real news? No, this is real news. news. Oh, okay. That right. fake news Tony. shit doesn't exist here. <sighs> Yes. This is all factual based. News. Okay, well let's uh <laughs> the real before life we, before we get too invested in this description. <laughs> Whoa. Let's hear it first and uh, we'll we'll be the judge of that. What do we got? So uh Xbox just released their new firmware software updates. Confirmed. Um, That's it, true. Right. It does include things like allowing you to use um custom pictures for your gamer tag photo. I have changed mine. Do I um, I, I my my box can get this automatically. Yeah, I don't you will. Go get yeah, it. I will show you. I, I haven't even it. like if you haven't even already done it, then it's on and playing. But yeah. I didn't know there was a new thing. I can show you how to do it. I've done it and it worked. I want to do it. Um, they're allowing you to use like the mixer uh, that that Microsoft mixer music service. Um, like you can actually use that and play that while you're playing games and other things now. Oh, so stream. You can co-stream. You can co-stream. We, it. We've it's figured sweet. out how to let you play your own. Playlists in a video game. <laughs> so if something Which we were able to do on the Xbox 360, so let me yeah. tell you what or this the original means. Xbox. The yeah, what this what means is that fuck? Scott, you could start up a stream of, let's say, when Destiny Two comes out. Let's just say let's just put uh, we have a little there. fire team going, right? Yeah, uh, you can stream that. I can join you and stream my side, and you can stream your side, and it would be like split screen streaming. If you think in terms of like um, what. Uh, we Golden Eye, like right? Like how Golden Eye, four player, right? Yeah. Uh, one, two, three, four type of a quadrant. Uh-huh. Uh huh. You can stream that way with Mixer in a group sort of setting. So Mixer Sorry. allows you to do more than just yeah. streaming music. Uh, co- that's cool. So on top as, of so like it makes Twitch not as appealing with multiplayer if you're in a group setting. Okay. Sort of. Uh, that way, so it's kind of it's kind of cool. It's cool. So like like Randy and I could each be streaming out to Have Twitch, we, and it would show both yeah, of yeah. ours. So theoretically, yeah. we yeah. could be recording a, a four person stream with. Yeah, you know, I've, good, I've not limit? tried anything beyond. I'm wondering. Like, I don't I'm wondering know. if you're if you're already uh, online in a party yeah. playing a game and you start streaming. Does things start slowing down, or does it just run normally? No, I mean like, you're only like, you're how's, you're playing on well you. You'd still be work? playing on your machine, right? You're still so it doesn't do anything different than you would normally streaming a single game from your. Oh, but yeah, the recording it doesn't, it doesn't box change. is what monitoring it's, all of them, or no? no there, there's no there. It's 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 all going to the same place, which is like essentially like a cloud. So it's going to mixer, and okay. all the information you're uploading is going to the same place. So okay, it's. Yeah, it's just like Twitch, but it integrates. So we would go back and watch it later. Like we, you wouldn't have while while you're streaming and I'm streaming, we're together. Like I'm not going to be looking at your. Screen. No, you wouldn't I'm not see. Yeah, yeah, you screen. you totally wouldn't. No, okay. you would only okay. see your okay. your business, and then it all gets kind of compiled into a video that goes out. Oh, okay, that's kind of um, cool. It's kind of neat. Um, I get it. Yeah, and there's. I know, was confused. At this first. mixer thing that they're throwing out there is actually pretty damn cool. I've been like kind of following it, as, you know, from the get go. Okay. And um, it's good. It's real good. Um, I, I don't know that they're trying. They're not trying to like ditch t- like Twitch. Twitch is still there. It's very much a part yeah. of that ecosystem. It's still in there. But like the mixer is cool. It's really fucking cool. And it's. I think it's just Microsoft like IP. I think it's just their. I, it was thing. Uh, really. It was like Beam. I think is what it was called. It before. was Beam. Yeah, and then they bought it. So yeah, they they've. Turned it into their own thing. Yeah, yeah they, so they it basically is, they integrated it into their own. So it's pretty cool. Yeah. So it's Xbox right on. only technology. It's kind of yeah. Neat. 
but it's it's technology that you would need like third party hardware and or software to do previous to this. Okay, so, okay. To be able to do this kind of stuff, you would have to have some pretty um, specialized equipment to do it. So um, there's that uh, convenience uh, that they're building it right into the Xbox. Right on. That's. I'm curious Sweet. now. So uh, the the next little item up is uh, Nintendo is coming out with a new 2DS. I know they're on the 3DS, but it's a 2DS XL. So it's a little bit bigger. Um, it's it's actually it's got the same screen size. It's like the 4.8 inch whatever screen that they've had for a while now on it. On the, D- um, the on DS the, thing. On this DS, okay. yeah. Um, I don't know exactly why, other than they're like from what I've seen, they're. They're moving some stuff around on it, so like your um, your micro SD card is in a more convenient place. You're not having to pull your battery out, so you can swap, hot swap that. Yeah, to, okay. um, that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, there's been some complaints about it. Like the battery life apparently is less than a 3ds XL. That's weird. Don't know why. That's like, what we want. Maybe we get a yeah. firmware update for that because that yeah. seems weird. To yeah, me. it's. I mean, it's it's but, it I seems a Sounds little like a step back. Oh, and it seems a little useless. I mean, you're yeah. basically making a a, a new 2DS, mm-hmm. and we're on 3DS at this point, and another thing. You know, it's yeah. like, why are we doing this, you know, at this point? Yeah. So. Well, and I think that, I, well, I'd heard, and I don't know, and maybe this is in your in your list, that the 3DS potentially could be, slowing production but i don't know if that's like 100 percent accurate or not yeah i don't i don't really know because but, yeah. the 3ds xl isn't that old i mean no no it's not and so it's like and you've got a you've got a handheld slash console in the switch so why right. are you i mean you're you're creating new hardware that may be kind of redundant yeah you know so well, they released the NES Classic and the soon-to-be SNES Classic. Yeah, ah, uh, those to those me are nos- kind of seem fucking redundant. So you know what? But those are a nostalgia. Like they can, yeah. they can, they know that they're making money off nostalgia with that. So think yeah, about when but they they're released- probably making more two XLs than they are classics and SNES classics combined. Yeah. Right. So I'm just gonna look for the originals. Well, it's a different hardware, I but mean, also you, you gotta know. think in terms of like when they released that NES Classic. It was holiday of last year, yeah. And this SNES Classic, I it looks it's gonna like be holiday of this year. Go in the same direction. They're just trying to collect them fucking holiday bucks. Yeah. Well, they could I'm make sure, more sure. holiday but bucks if they released more of them. Because they are doing that yeah. this this yeah. time well, around. Yeah, like six more. <laughs> well, I think maybe that first run was to sort of like, let's just test the market. Let's see if we can tug it. These nostalgic heartstrings, like how many people will actually fucking buy this thing? Are we yeah. way over... Comp- like, are we, are, we, are we thinking it's going to be a lot? Because they knew, I think. They, they wouldn't have made it if they didn't know... That it was going to be a lot. Like, they had to have known. Well, and then I, the know. other thing that they're doing to counteract it is a lot of the online retailers, you're only allowed to pre-order one. Yeah. They're only going to allow you to order yeah, one. Yeah, Amazon will only give pre-order. you, like, one, I think. The, they're they're allowing thing. you to pre-order this one, um, yeah. from what yeah. I saw. Well, hmm. But not yet. Yeah, not, yeah, no, it's not, yeah. it's not supposed to be opening up for a while. Hey, still. I want Xmas if you July, want one, damn it. pre-order it, I suggest. If you really want one, and I, yeah. this one, I think is, if you have a reason to buy one of these fucking things, either one, get this one, because this one is the one, it's got nothing but fucking bangers on it. Got nothing but gold. They're I mean. just all, re- it's a real good lineup, and you get Star Fox 2, which was never released. Right, it was never even. And released. you'll be getting that in this, that will apparently emulate it, um, just fine. So, like, yeah, pre-order that motherfucker. And, like, you pre-order it because you just want to make sure you get one if you're in that crowd that really wants one, you know, because it uh, is. It's, it's yeah. totally a nostalgic, uh, you know, it. that's that's what it's for. And I suggest definitely pre-ordering it if you want to try to get one. Um, but they haven't even come up for pre-order yet here in the U.S., so, like, no. we can't even get them yet um, for this year. But, like, yeah, but they're trying to get them Christmas dollars. You know, that's what that's all about, I, yeah. I say uh, last little bit, uh, we've got some, uh, VR news. Um, Oculus Rift is got a sale going on right now for, it's a little bit of a bundle. It's the headset and two of the touch controllers. So you're not having to buy those separately, first of all. 
Um, and they're running for, I believe it's three ninety nine right now. And then once the sale's over, they're going to go to full price of four ninety nine. So they're coming really? down from their, I think it was six seven hundred dollars previously. So they're on sale right now for four hundred. The, the regular price with the included controllers is going to be a, supposedly five hundred. Those controllers, like you had to buy a pair of them, and that was like another hundred dollars. So I mean, you're looking at a system wow. that was okay. eight hundred dollars yeah. or so minimum. It's a lot cheaper. It's yeah. it's gone down quite a bit. I mean, VR is is just it's cheaper in general now, um, which is like well, you know, all tech kind of does that after a period of time. Yeah, but right. now you're, it's you know. like it's to a point where, and it's Oculus too. So it's like it's 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 the one. It's a pretty good it's the big VR one. It was one. the first one, you know. It's a good VR. Like the Vive is probably better, I'd say, in terms of like quality of experience and stuff like that, with a slight edge. But I'd say Oculus is like right behind it. That's a pretty damn okay. good. Like I, if I were to get, let's say, okay, if I was tor- torn between this and like PSVR, uh, oh. the nice thing about PSVR is that like, okay, if you have a PlayStation, you can. You can get that and play that, right? And it's plug and play, that's right? Point, but if know. you have a PC that's beasty enough to like run this, yeah, you can really go nuts. get this instead because it's way, way better than that PSVR. I don't want to say it's garbage. It's not very good. It's not a very good system. Um, so yeah, I'd totally go Oculus on that. Um, additionally, Oculus, uh, some news. There's talk that they're going to be coming out with basically a standalone unit. Um, you don't need a computer. You don't need a phone. Be no like wires, their own sort of console. Like, yeah, like it's all built into one. So basically, it's a yeah. PC on your okay. face. So it's kind of going where it needs to be, and it's supposed to be fairly no inexpensive. Wires. Well, I don't think yeah. it's the reason why the so, old one is on sale. <laughs> maybe, if, yeah. maybe if it was a helmet. Basically. I mean, you're not, you're not going to want the old one on the goggles. Well, I don't. You know I don't I mean? know. You don't, I don't. You know, no I, I've not that much weight. Yeah. I've not seen. Face. Yeah. There's, there's no seen, prototype but, or anything. Yeah, yeah there, there's that nothing that we've that seen. seen. Um, but you know, Polygon is okay, reporting okay. this. I mean, and they're talking cheap, like two hundred dollars. So you're talking huh. a VR setup where you don't need a phone, like the Google Gla- like the Google VR that's out there, or the Google Cardboard. I think is what they call it for a while. Yeah. Um, or like the the current Oculus or the Sony, uh, you know, VR or that the HTC Vive, where you need a computer or some sort of console. They've kind of, if they can package that all into one unit, mm-hmm. I mean, and sell it for $200. It would be nice to be able to yeah. not have to buy yeah, it. Like you're saying, like, all cool. that extra stuff yeah. or have a, a separate extra component Keep it nice that you already have purchased yeah. Yeah. to run it. It would be nice to just throw down a couple hundred bucks and be like, yeah, call it this good. is it. Yeah. Give me some games specifically for this. Yeah. Upload them, yeah. Yeah. That would be, so that would I be have heard. Fun. I have heard that it it possibly can be, like, uh, plugged into a PC, and that's how you will get your software for it. Like updates and stuff. Yeah, but I don't, you know, that's definitely not a final product. I don't know if that's going to be the case. Oh, I wouldn't be so shocked yeah. if you can do it off like a micro SD like or something. That, that's, you know? that's what I've been hearing is right. that it would be more of a, a flash drive type setup. Uh-huh. You know, so that could could be the case on delivery. Like, I don't know. We'll or see. Wi-Fi or Bluetooth yeah, or something, you know, yeah. too. You know. Um, but the flash drive is what I read about earlier is that that's kind of the the main vessel of delivery for that stuff. Um, but, you know, we'll see how that goes. I don't know. So um, I guess my question on this, though, is if if VR hits, you know, a couple hundred dollars, would you guys actually be a little more interested? I know we've all been skeptical looking at an $800 um, piece of hardware that you have, yeah. to, atta- that you have to also I mean, have to attach another $500 plus. I mean, if the development gets there for the software, then... then- yeah, like well, if, yeah. What can you, know. you plug it in? If I can run it off the Xbox, well, no. The current, well, like the one that they're any. talking about, is it's yeah, yeah. it's self contained unit, so you won't you have run to it run it off your Xbox. It'll run everything off itself for a couple hundred dollars. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Well, I you know it's maybe. all like, well. Okay, so it's let's all say speculation. I have the point. headset. Let's pretend I gotta like provide that's my the own case. earphones, and I can just use the Xbox controller. Sure, it'll take sure. an uh, fucking sure. HDMI let's pretend like that all works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, I would just. Shit, I would sit in that chair in the middle of my garage and just. Get- <laughs> this would be only. This could only happen for an hour at a time, maybe. I mean, right. before the kid comes looking for me, yeah, or right. somebody's coming to tell me to do something that I'm not doing because yeah. I'm playing the thing. But yeah. whatever, you know. Yeah. That- well, you. 
You're, everyone's supposed to put pants on, so yeah. I mean, it's just a normal thing. Why do she I have, have to wear, wear pants in your own home? Gotta have them in the garage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you're in the garage and the garage door's open, you better have some goddamn pants on. I mean, on. you don't right. always have to have pants on in the garage. That's what boxes are for. Yeah. There are exceptions. Yeah. Yeah, dude, I, I don't know. I've been there. I think, like, pick a game. Uh, you don't think, like, an uh, immersive... Any Call of Duty, any Battlefield, yeah. Battlefront, yeah. Fucking, any type of any first a, person like the shooter. Alien, uh, any kind of horror survival. I'm thinking that'd be great. Like if you had like the, the little crazy. controllers that they yeah. have, like the Oculus does have like yeah. these little hand controls. Yeah. Like, if you had the controllers and everything, like that was all kind of a part of it. Um, yeah, I think that'd be pretty fucking good. You know, that'd be pretty rad. I would totally I'd, be done. Yeah, yeah, yeah for that. a few hundred bucks. Why the fuck yeah. not? I mean, why not? I'd, I mean, it's no, that, that's cheaper than a Xbox One X. Seven. Yes, it is. Yes. So yeah, like, I mean not? it's cheaper. It's really it'd be cheaper than everything. But a uh, uh, what is the uh, switch going for? Is it two hundred now or is it three hundred? I think the switch is two ninety nine. Is two ninety nine? Yeah. If you so, if it's bones, going yeah. for that two hundred, it'd definitely be lower yeah. than anything yeah. else out there. Anyway, yeah. I'd need at least five games or more on that to consider purchasing it. <laughs> yeah, if Ben had it, I might try it out. But I think there's other shit I'd rather buy for that kind of money. Sure. You know, okay, some yeah. better action figure. Something. Hmm. Something. Like it would definitely, it would definitely make me think about like it. W- I would definitely think about it at a two to three hundred dollar range a lot more than I would at like a, a six the to eight hundred dollar range. And, that, and I'm just needing like, no, other that's... hardware on top of it. it yeah, right now, that's. Yeah, I think that's the real uh, bottleneck for a lot of people. Yeah. Is you not only have to buy a six, seven, eight hundred dollar piece of hardware somewhere around there. You also have to have a computer or a console or that can run it. That can yeah. that can feed it the basically all of it everything it needs. Yeah. You know, can feed it the software information it needs. So yeah. you a know pl- a plug and play VR would definitely be pretty cool. Yeah, like you don't need anything else. Yeah. Any other news for us, Tony? Um uh, I think that really it? right we, now, I mean being summer um it is kind of quiet. Yeah, summer is t- kind of the time where it's like, eh, hey, we'll play some video games. Let's let's get yeah. outdoors. Let's do some. <laughs> Speaking let's, of playing video let's games, let's do some real living. Uh, have you been playing anything, Scott? Um, uh, yes and no. I'm still trying to go through. Uh, yes I'm and trying to. No. Yes and no. Okay. I'm trying to finish up uh, Ghost Recon. I'm kind of at that point with the game where it's like I'm either gonna. Oh, okay. You start investing a lot more money, or I'm just going to finish the game. I think I'm at the finish the game point. Okay. Okay. Um, with that, I have been requested by a listener to review a game, so I've downloaded that, and we're getting into that part. In that process. Um, right on. So there should be in the next couple of weeks, hopefully, some a game review nice. of sorts. Uh, but no, I've been listening. I've actually been doing a little bit of watching TV. More so, um, particularly Castlevania came out, I believe, this yeah. week. Yeah, it's yeah. It's going to release. On Netflix. Netflix. On ne- uh, on ne- Exorante. It's good. Yeah. yeah it's a anime on cartoon Netflix. style. Netflix. Except, what the fuck, Netflix? It's only four fucking episodes. It's only four episodes. What they the do that on the They teasing you. They teasing you on the, for that yeah. They do it. They, they do that. Dude, yeah. it takes it's a coming. long time to animate it's shit, man. Uh, it's good. It's I've only watched the two it's like, episodes. Uh, it's a Western anime type. It's not like uh, it's not quite anime. Yeah, it's Japan anime. It's like yeah. French. It's like, yeah. I, thought, I, I thought it was done really well. Sort of. Like, yeah, it's, no, it's yeah, detailed. it's good. It looks good. Yeah, it's like it's like anime mixed with like that old Anne Flux animation yes. from like the MTV, yeah. whatever the hell that was called, Liquid Television. Liquid Television. Yeah. It's like that yeah. Anne Flux. It's, it's MTV's sort of oddities. that yeah. mixed with I anime, not as detailed. Us all. Yeah, <laughs> but it's, it's remember, remember <laughs> the Max. Oh, the Max was the Max shit. Max yeah. the shit, dude. That was a good one. Love the Max. That was a good one. Um, You're not even real. Yeah, yeah. man, that Castlevania is pretty good, oh, though. I, I did like but, it. I liked yeah. it. Been watching watching Castlevania, so I mean that's pretty sweet. Everybody look at look at that, like that, so we get more episodes of that. That was some good good yeah. shit, man. Yeah, it, what, just kind of going back to Netflix though. I don't know if you noticed and or been reading any about it. They're actually canceling shows now that they're like they'll they're just not yeah, Do they're it, bringing they're, in the viewership. Like they're doing Orange it now. Is the like new ordinary no. television. Um, yeah, they're, they're actually nobody's they're watching. The nobody's shows that aren't working, it. they're hacking them off. They're actually yeah. like you know, even if they get really good. So with Netflix for a long time, there was uh, hey, this show gets great critical uh, claim. Right. We're just going to keep going with it, you know, no matter what. Like 
the viewership really didn't matter. Now they're kind of they're they're kind of maturing into a more okay. like a like a like, like HBO a does yeah. or even yeah. you know has standard- anybody watched uh, Flaked? No, I've watched, yeah, no, I've watched. I've, I watched last season. Of, the Will Arnett, Arnett right? one on yeah. on Netflix. Uh, I, I watched didn't, last season. I didn't season. get past the first half of the first season. Yeah, Netflix yeah. keeps trying to recommend. Oh, it, dude, yeah. dude. Dude, it keeps popping up. Yeah, well, ninety-eight percent of the recommended anything is a Netflix original. <laughs> always, and it, has, it typically has nothing to do with what I just fucking finished. If we're getting yeah. into Netflix here, this new fucking yeah. rating system, I fucking the thumbs hate up, it. thumbs down. I fucking hate that. Oh, I, I, I don't need. I don't rate anything. It, sometimes well, no, I just on, kind like, of like things because they had the stars, yeah. and that was good. Yeah. That's great. That's what everybody has fucking done since the beginning of time. Right. It's X, not YouTube. X out Come of on. X. And now it's either you like it or you don't. Yeah. And no. what if it's just like, eh, it's good, but That's it's not great. That's where the great. two and three yeah. stars came in great. Yes. <laughs> right. So, Jess, have you been playing anything? Uh, uh, I've actually played quite a bit since I last graced you. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while. It's been a while, yeah. You probably a, while, a little yeah. bit of a, a recap here. You can <laughs> uh, offer so at least. So, most recently, um, I finished uh, Walking Dead Season 3. Which yeah. Which was really the good. The Telltale? What or the yes, Telltale? Telltale. Okay. Yeah. Uh, really good story again. You know, I always get a little pissed off because I get too involved in the yeah. story and oh. miss the fucking prompt. And then I'm fucking <laughs> yeah. dead. That's my problem. Now, with that one's well. based off of the comics, correct? Uh, sort of, but not really. It's its own story. It's its own story. Yeah. But occasionally, okay. like, characters that you know pop in for a minute. Okay. Uh, but Make that was really good. little cameos and whatnot. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Cameos. Yeah. Well, they've done that with all of, most of their That their Game games. of Thrones one is pretty fucking good. Yeah, I played yeah. that one, too. That did you like that good. one? That one's good, I did good, like huh? it. It's like, yeah. what? This is it? Where's the second fucking yeah. season? It's cool. They did that one so cool because yeah. it's kind of like a behind-the-scenes version of the story, and then right. you are there, okay. but like... You can see you're not what's one of the happening. Main characters. Like, the actual story is <laughs> happening in Game of Thrones, but like you're kind of in the background... <laughs> pulling fucking strings like you know what i mean like making right. the thing happen right on that, that one was cool i like that i like how they had like all the different characters that you played in each different section versus like i'm just yeah. this one person straight through. yeah they skip you uh, around yeah that yeah that one was pretty damn good well that, that's how the the books in game of throne if, if you yep. haven't i mean you're jumping around left and yep. right in the books and that but yeah anything like else you've too. been playing recent or uh not well sort of recently because i turned it on the other day uh since i've been gone i know before i left I was going to start playing uh, Dragon Age Inquisition. Oh. oh, yeah. So I played that for a little bit. I'm only up to like 199 hours. <laughs> that one, yeah, <laughs> you could spend quite a long time. Just getting uh, started. Just getting started. It was... Getting your toes wet. Yeah. It was okay. <laughs> um, not my favorite, although you would not guess that based on the amount of time that I've played it. <laughs> it's because you don't have a choice. I had that <laughs> relationship with that game also where I was like, I like that first one a lot better, but like I, yeah. I right. kept playing yeah. it because I was like, "There's so I mean, much what, shit am I to not do." Gonna play it, yeah, and then it's like as you yeah. as you do like the tape, like you're doing the war the the war table, like the the what do you call yeah, it? Yeah, the war table. Mm-hmm. Yeah, when you're when you're doing all that and you like unlock all the shit and then like I just kept wanting to like go like zone. do the stuff that like it's unlocking. I'm like I did all that. Got to a point where I was like, okay, well you can do all this stuff, and then I had like the DLC with the one that I bought, so it was like. You can do all this shit too after you're done being like the main yeah, story. Yeah, the DLC too. And yeah, it was like, Ugh, I'm not and that's, done yet. Okay, that's the pain in the ass. Yeah, it's like so mm-hmm. much. I got to I paid for it. I might yeah. as well do it. So and then in there. because I'm an achievement whore, after you beat it, you can put on these other fucking things to make yeah. it harder yeah. for other achievements. Right. And oh, okay. That's basically, where I am right now. Okay. Like, okay. I'm only at level five, but I have to beat yeah. this fucking thing and. Can't. Yeah. Yeah. They make it damn near impossible to do it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's that's one of the complaints I would I would say I'd have about with Bioware is not that they can't write a good story or anything like that, but like some of their achievements are just insane. Yeah. It's like really, do you have to make it this damn <laughs> hard pretty, on purpose? Well, some of them are. Yeah. And only really ten. Hard. Only ten achievement points for that. Right. Like, bullshit. Yeah. It's been five weeks trying to get that thing. <laughs> what the shit? Yeah. Sometimes. Not, Sometimes. It's not scaled to difficulty. <laughs> Anything else? Ben, have uh, you been playing, or, or I, Jess, have you, you been know, playing anything I, I else? I fired up. I, I went back Go into ahead, Mad Max. Mad Max. Mad Max. Yeah, I, just, I saw. I, I, I actually it. saw you playing a game on oh, my really? freaking I, feed. Yeah. I was like, holy shit. I, 
I said, Ben's play video games? I want to, I gotta clear the map. I want to clear the map. Yeah. I've, I've knocked everything out. I've done everything you can do. And now there's like, there's literally like a hundred or maybe 200 plus scrap Aww. points to go get. Oh, like, it's okay. just, it's a map. It's a point on the map where there might be a person to, that I have to beat up and I can take his, his little his pile, gear or his little sack of money. Yeah. Basically. You know, or there might be something you have to like, mess around with yeah there's something. usually a couple guys to beat up and they have like two scrap piles yep. and you just you just you just claim them and i'm oh. taking the scrap pile that's mine not that i'm hurting for it i have like over sixty six thousand <laughs> scrap scrap is like money i can i bought everything there is to buy it's just a little i own I all the base all, all the safe houses are forts in all the each. base belong to there's you like four of them all the base have you not 100 percent of that game yet have i have not? not okay i haven't i i so thought i i, I don't I, I honestly i'm not sure what achievements i'm missing yeah we need to maybe we, we uh, you, know, you can check that right <laughs> yeah but Easily? that takes maybe we do like it's an not achieve. that easy no. that, like you hit that, the fucking start button and then you scroll and boop. okay so what do you get for the last five achievements that are this achievement is a secret to unlock oh, it, shit. You do something Google in game. That it's like shit, yeah. man. You, go, you go to name this game and okay, well, now, now you're googling and you're, you're and fucking you. YouTubing and googling, and I'm not gaming, and I'm like, <laughs> I just want to drive around and kill fucking people <laughs> and, and collect yes. their fucking scrap. Yeah. It's way you know? easier than you're making. It I mean, sound. that sounds like my <laughs> so, it's, it's Tuesday. It's, it's really. not, dude. I, I want the same things. Okay. So Tell me what the fucking secret achievements are. Then I I didn't bother to look them up. I, I wasn't. You got to. I just want to. I got the map whited out. There's no. There's zero scrotus threat. Yeah, on my dude, map, dude, but no, there's all no these, scrotus. Those, all these. I mean, that sounds that good. Anybody. Like a doctor would probably right? be like, "That's good." <laughs> there's all these. There's, there's, you know, loot points you know throughout everywhere. I've, you know I've actually got three. I've got two of the. On there, there's four <laughs> quadrants, five quadrants. What do you call that? Set, set trints. What? Uh, anyway, what? the Quad- map is in five quadrants? sections. Yeah, there's, there's like four main quadrants, and then there's like the gas town itself is is oh, its, its main, own little middle, yeah. its own little section. Okay. So each section of the map, they're 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 all white. I've I've got them. I've got everything cleared, except for. The the last one, and then there's a well. There's it's too hard to explain. There's a, the Essence, dunes. You are yes. the desert. The desert is open. There's there's like a there's I don't know. There's probably Waste forty man. more. You could probably look that things up on, out there on, yeah. online, right? Like on Google, just look up the Mad Max map. Oh, I have the map. I have yeah, everything okay. marked yeah, yeah. on the map. I, okay. I've got. He's it. just got to go. It's just a matter of going yeah, yeah. to each yeah, point okay. and okay. flipping the switch. To yeah. I, I just want to get it all. Yeah, yeah. Done. Yeah. I mean, I, I built this fucking car. I, I, I've been now there. it's like I'm gonna drive it across <laughs> this map and do every fucking thing there is. To hey, do let with me it. tell you about yeah. a little game called Skyrim. That I uh, oh yeah, yeah. I've been there. Just you'll get it. You just want to go down and take some time, patience. Yeah. Anything else? Not necessarily a new game, but I'm back into an old game. Anything else, sir? No. Right. no. Well, we got the, we just got the Dreamcast replaced. Oh yeah. So Ooh, I mean, yeah. we can head to head on tennis now, which is always a blast. Yeah. Uh, you know, that was fun. Yeah, we yeah. were playing a little bit before we jumped in. So. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, Randy, anything else you, or anything you've been playing new? Um, yeah, I, you know, I've been I've been tinkering with some games. Uh, finished a couple. I think I'm gonna wait, and we'll I'll report on that maybe like next episode. Um, okay. but, but I do, I did post some reviews. If you want to see some reviews, I actually wrote some reviews that are on www.namelessgamerspdx.com. Um, and I actually tweeted them too. So if you're on, follow us on our Twitter, you'll, you'll see those on there. Um, games that I've been playing. Um, I mean, I'll give names now. We'll talk a little bit about it next week. You know, we'll go into it in a little more detail, but like, uh, what remains of Edith Finch, uh, was fucking great. Thimbleweed Park. Um, and then uh, Oxen Free by uh, I think. Oh uh, yeah, what was it? Night Schoolers Studios. Oh okay. Um, also played 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 that too. Um, and those are all all on our website. You can find them there. NamelessGamersPDX.com. If you want to read them ahead of time, but yeah, but yeah, next uh, next episode we're gonna uh, we'll go a little bit more into that and talk about it. Yeah, cool, good stuff. So I uh, played a game that I mentioned last. Um, Last episode that I picked up, um, it's an older game. It's not exactly new. Uh, South Park Stick of Truth. Oh, how are you liking it? Uh, well, it's it's a fairly short game, as Randy and Scott, we both were discussing earlier. Um, completed that in a couple days. Um, but it's pretty damn funny. I mean, it's South Park, so it's got it's the fucking crazy... It's real South Park, right? Yeah, it's yeah, really yeah. South Park. I told it's, you. It's yeah, it really South good. Park. So <laughs> yeah. it's... It's one of those games that's like easy and 
fun. Yeah, yes. it's got a little. Yeah, there is fun. Yeah, you know, like if the storyline. If the storyline sucked for it South Park, it's simple too, which is nice. Yeah, it's yeah. easy to play. Yeah. And like, if the storyline sucked, you know, South Park yeah. fans would have been pissed. Oh yeah, yeah. and yeah. like it, it really does. It lives up to what it South Park the- has put out there they did, in yeah. their shows and their expectations yeah. of like anything involved. And it looks like their shows too. where it's got the weird. Random twist and just the yep. most <laughs> fucked up thing you can do. And I'm looking yeah. forward to see. Yeah. I'm looking forward to see what this next one's the fractured butthole. Yeah. Fractured yeah. butthole. Yeah. 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 It's supposed to come out. It's they, been pushed they, back they like, like twice like now. They're talking maybe times. October. Yeah. They delayed the first one too. I, a lot. I keep seeing like yeah. pre-order releases. But yeah. Like, hey, yeah, pre-order but, it. And it's yep. like, no, if you're not giving me a release date. I'm not giving you a goddamn cent. <laughs> Remember you the old days enough. of the $5 pre-order? I am no. going to pre-order oh, Destiny I never 2. Pre-ordered I think shit. that's going to be about as brave as I get this year. Destiny Maybe. 2? Maybe. We'll see what else comes out. But uh, yeah, I'll pre-order Destiny 2 just because I want to play the beta. Um, so I have something uh, to yeah. tell everybody about when we come here. You have to pre-order to play the beta? Yeah, that's no. how, well, it's, that's it's a guarantee enter. into the beta. Yeah, yeah, that's how they enter you into the beta. So uh, I'll be doing that. Um, it'll be, be good. So, yeah. so the the last thing I've been playing was uh, Final Fantasy XIV. Uh-huh. Um, they've got the new expansion out now, Stormblood. It's been out about a month now. Storm yeah, how how you doing with that? How's that? How, um, what's the opinion now? How's it going? I, I'm in, I'm enjoying what I've played so far. I've not really gotten into stuff. the story all that much. Yeah. Um, it's it's I don't play it all the time or anything like that. So I'll play it for an hour here, okay, a couple hours yeah. there. Go do something else, or like I'll do. Well, yeah, RPGs. You know, RPGs. You, sometimes you don't want to commit. Yeah, yeah. Nine hour yeah session, and it, the nice thing with it being with. a an MMO RPG where it's very first or single player oriented in the story wise. Okay, you can stop and just take off whenever you want. It's not like yeah, that is, that is Final handy. Fantasies yeah. where you would have to yeah. wait till you get to a save point or get to the open right. world or you know find some way to save your game so you're not losing a bunch of progress. Right. So. You don't want to watch that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Cinematic over again, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Or just have to do what have you do that? You know, yeah. uh, thirty minutes of fucking fighting through this crowd. Yeah. Of- have to do that fifteen <laughs> seconds of silence over again because we'll never make it, boys <laughs> and oh. girls. <laughs> Fuck, we'll never make it. Fuck yeah. on that. That's a reference to the way we record our podcast. It is. <laughs> I, I couldn't tell if you were serious right there. I was like, okay, yeah. I'm, I'm not going to be the one to screw it no, up. No, that's, <laughs> that's just how we do it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, any, any other, uh, anything well, um, not a game, but did go see the new Spider-Man this last uh, week. Right. Yeah. Saw it on Tuesday. I miss going yeah. to movies. It was fun. Um, Sucks to be you, doesn't What'd it? What'd you think? You? I thought it was really yeah. good. <laughs> um, I don't know about you guys. Yeah. I thought it was good. I liked it. It's okay, Ben. I liked it. I like. I'm not a huge Spider-Man fan, but I liked yeah. it. I thought it was better. I mean, than, there's nothing I can do to help you. But uh, right, right the now, Tobey yeah. Maguire, yeah. and I don't know that Andrew I ever Garfield. Saw. Oh, I saw the first one of the. Andrew Nobody Garfields. cares about those. The Spider-Mans. second. <laughs> well, the <laughs> Sam, the Sam Raimi Spider-Mans were were okay. I think. I think. They I think were cool the casting was was kind of a poor choice in those. Sam Raimi. And, well, cool kid. Tobey. I don't huh? know. He, he was a yay. Tobey Maguire looks, a, looks right. Everybody wants to bitch about Tobey Maguire. Fun, it's always fun to see Bruce Campbell in a on, Sam Raimi project. Hey, yeah. that's always entertaining to me. <laughs> what if Tobey Maguire was Toe for Grace? They're basically the same. Toe for Grace was Spider Man, right? You know what? He might have been a lot. Heard that was was Brock, right? He was Venom. What a fucking no. He was. Yes, he was. Well, you know. Yeah. Anyway, but I like, like I like the first Christian one because or I like the Batman. new one because they they did a good throwback to a lot of the um, the old eighties um, Rat Pack or Brat Pack okay. movies. Yeah. Yeah, um, they did a funny. lot of throwback to a lot of that. So saved it. I thought you were going like Sammy Davis Jr. No, 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 no. I thought you were heading that direction and you Brat turned Pack, it around. Yeah. <laughs> Brat, uh, good, good yeah. save. B R A T. Yeah. So there was, there was some good good uh, throwbacks we to that as go. well. It was that's good. funny. That's cool. Sinatra. It was good. It was entertaining. It wasn't kind. Of, it wasn't like a letdown. It wasn't like some weird emotional roller coaster that the last two fucking Marvel movies yeah, have put every been. fucking person on. <laughs> it's been weird. It's a it's a fucking a, mo- a roller coaster of emotions, Ben. You watch these fucking movies and you'll be like, "Yeah, dude, a which, roller coaster wait, which, of emotions, which ones? dude." We're talking Logan. Oh, We're talking Logan. Galaxy Garden Guardians. Of I haven't Galaxy. seen. I haven't seen. I've seen that too. one myself. I've not, not seen Guardians. Too. I don't. I'm I not going to spoil so the shit out of it, but 
the hair, I, I know. baby. The hair, man. Oh, I know Kurt what Russell's happens. Hair I mean, I, I understand what has dreamy. to happen. Dude, it's like watching <laughs> fucking Snake Blitzkin walk yeah. the fuck around. Yeah. Yep. Just <laughs> said <sighs> that, that it's dreamy, and I used the word dreamy. main earlier <laughs> <laughs> to describe. I mean, I think I've also described it as works. fabulous. Fabulous. Okay. Fabulous. I mean, well, it could be, you can even describe it as a dream. Would you main. say it's a fabulous main? Yes. Main. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. You're expecting him at any point in time to yeah. be like, Rawr. Rawr. You know, at the opening, you know, it's a real, you know, it's a real fucking hoot. Oh, hey, Kurt Russell, what are you seventy? That's a real, cool. That's cool. How about that fucking? Show me that big old mane. Oh, dude, yeah. shake he's that still, big old. He still got it, though, mane. man. He was yeah, great he in. Everything. The Hateful Eight. You guys seen the Hateful Everything. Eight? Everything. That good. That's pretty. That's oh, pretty good. That one. Like, I, I can watch that one over and over again. We well, you. about the first half. Yeah. Okay. Kurt. Yeah. Anyway. All right. But yeah. Okay. So yeah. Yeah. Spider Man Homecoming. It's was good. hilarious. Okay. Yeah. We'll get him with the NGPX. The uh, copy that stamp of approval. I did. You know, I I wasn't as as a as a fan Roger of the the genre. Or the the history of it, I wasn't too big on like the the name changes of people. Yeah, okay. If you go watch it, you'll hear it at the end, and it's like it was a sigh of relief before the movie was over. Okay, no spoiler alerts. Okay, but go watch the fucking movie. It's great. Sounds like yeah. Scott has some reservations. Maybe some questions. Yeah. No, um, um, that that being, I, th- I think I think he might have those nitpicky ones that Scott gets because he's such a comic book. Well, fan. Scott usually those, asks those a lot nit- of questions, Tony. Those nitpicky like little he's, like he's that's man. what I want. I want I want a fucking on. I want a critical thinking eye. Like, yeah, ah. hell yeah. What other questions do you have, Scott? Do you, I mean about that, or are you talking about video games in general? Maybe? Well. How about the question of the episode? Well, about things first of all, the question of this episode started out with with A, but since we're gonna fuck with you because we could do that, Randy, we get I'm gonna to fuck with you because you got a great one. When you're building an avatar for a game, oh yeah, okay, that uh, allows you to just make a character if there's no any particular uh, ability uh, attributes that are changed. Either it be male or female, or yeah. however you make your character. How do you generally make your character? Do you actually make it look like you, or do you make it look like some weird character that might fit into the world? Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. How do you make your avatar? Yeah, your avatar. Your I your, like it. Your, your character, your sprite, your whatever the fuck you want to be. Yeah. You know what do you make? Yeah, I yeah. like it. That's uh. Yeah. No, there were that that will probably warrant a lot of fucking weird ass answers. Yeah. 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 Uh, horns? What, no what horns? Do you tail? Make? No tail? What do we Yeah, I mean about? if you're into that, uh, you know, type of thing. tattoos? <laughs> Scars, sure. yeah. eye patches, all of it, pirates, all of the above, With peg legs. <laughs> no, I do no. like a, I do Where like are a, we at? A good scar in the right place. In you the know, right place. I, I, agree I like. With I like that. some ink. Yeah. I like some ink on the it's on the character. Bad. You know, little ink. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Got make it. it. Make an avatar for us. Okay. I can. Yeah. Let me know. But tell us what you what you got yourselves. Yeah. Let us know. Hit us up at I lagged out. Uh, you can email us at namelessgamerspdx at gmail dot com. Uh, mm. I, yeah, we have Facebook too. Thanks Boys for and girls, I think it's about time to just wrap this rascal. Wrap, um, wrap, does anybody wrap it have up. anything else they want to throw? Anybody else have another log to throw on the fire? Before <laughs> <laughs> we ship it on off into the nether? Walnut. No? Nobody got no, I think we're good. Mm. All right. Well, if you have a question or comment, let us know. Um, like I mentioned, Twitter. Uh, follow us at I Lagged Out. Um, Again, you can email us there too. Actually, you can also search for us on Facebook. Just search for Nameless Gamers. Uh, yeah, that's PX. right. We have a thing. Yeah, and and, and we we do have a on the we do like the stuff. page yeah. there. You can you can uh, and we and we update it quite often. Actually, um, yeah, we, we throughout the week. Um, and Join all that good the stuff. faction. So, uh, Join us. Jess, thanks for being here. Thanks uh, for having yes, me, guys. We 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 love we yeah. love you, and Peace. we want you to be here more often. Um, yeah, so anytime you can make it, definitely come out. We want to have you here. Excellent. Everybody else, thanks for listening. Um, and, uh, I want to shout out Pig Squad, Portland Indie Game Squad. Uh, check them out, www.pigsquad.com. Wah, wah, wee <laughs> That was fucking real <laughs> weird. <laughs> that was great, dude. I want to hear that after Pig the Squad, man. Everything, dude. Wah, there it wah, is. Wee uh, <laughs> There. <laughs> I mean, that's a real bad pig, but there it is. Uh, Maybe it's <laughs> sick. <laughs> it's, kinda, it's in there. Never been better off dead. It is in there. If you want Everybody wants some. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>
Carry on. Everybody wants to. I, I don't know. Joke. I don't know that I need to. I, I feel like we're pretty much done here. Um, uh, yeah. No. Anyway, support us. www.patreon.com slash I lagged out. If you like the show, like what you hear, want to hear more. Uh, I, my microphone, I could use a new one. Uh, it's not a, not a good, not a good look, but it works. Works all right. For now. So there's that. Um, Thanks for reviewing and subscribe. Uh, share with a friend. Please share with a friend. Share with a family member, someone that would like uh, the show. And uh, other than that, I hate this map. Woo! Hey!